guys, it's Nancy here. Um, just coming back with another haul kind of thing for you. Whoops, Daisy. Um, and that is to share um, my new planner. Um, I have been using my Midori, um, my travels notebook, but I've been using it much more for notes, planning like crochet projects and different stuff like that. Um, and it wasn't kind of working for putting my sort of work life in um, and different things like that. So I kind of looked around a little bit. I've had a Filofax so that didn't work for me. It worked, but I don't know, not. I don't know, I've got two A5 Filofaxes still sitting around. Um, I decided to go with um, the Me and My Big Ideas Happy Planner. Um, I'd go with that. I kind of love it. Um, I don't know. I think it's just going to work well for work um, and planning that out. So I am slightly concerned because it's a little bit dinged up already being in my bag. But these covers are removable. So that's fine because I can easily put another cover on. And um, they've already got one cover pack out, which I will share in a second. So um, I got this one. It's got this beautiful um, metallic blue good things are going to happen on. I'm sure people will fit through with it. The reason I got this because I really like this part. So it's got the reading, planning, watching, trying, cooking, eating, drinking, thinking, pinning, crafting, going, loving, dreaming, feeling, listening, celebrating, improving. <laughs> so I really like that bit because I think you know that's kind of going to work well with mixing it with my scrapbooking. So of course this is an 18 month plan so it started in July so I took that big chunk out um, and then gone into the things and again I'm not going to flick through it in detail you've got a um, like a I'll do, show you a month I'm not using so you've got your month calendar on two pages and then each of these has a different um, header so they've each got something different um and then the weeks are set up so as I mean some of them have got you get a quote one week um, oh no maybe in Christmas you get oh look you get snow sort of themed ones all week for Christmas or month even for Christmas so that's good um, other ones you get um, like a washy kind of pattern one week and then you get quotes as well every other week so that's kind of quite cool so yeah I really like the format of the days going down and it's got three different columns so I can split it up for morning and afternoon at work have a box um, for stuff I need to get done at home in the evening or things I need to remember it's got a notes tab um, it's got the weekend which is good because I always <laughs> have like lots of projects and stuff planned and things I need to get done at the weekend um, especially how things are at the moment lighting is so bad I can't really film or do much in the evenings because lighting is t terrible I mean my video aren't lighted brilliantly I know that and that probably annoys some people um, but like taking photographs and stuff I need a little bit of daylight so I always like to make a list of things um, I've not gone mad into planning I've watched a few planning videos um, I like it but I kind of don't necessarily get it so this is using this disc system. Um, I've got some smaller bits of paper in here because um, the arc system fits in. So, and I've added some of the other pages that I ripped out from the other months just because I needed to do a few notes. And that is a parking ticket that I mean to remember to get my money back. Um, so yeah, I've just, this is a week where I've done some simple planning. I don't know. I don't know if I'd love it. I kind of like how pretty it is, but I'm not sure I'd do it every month, uh, every week. But just using some bits of washi. These are like the little cards that go in, which I really like these. I think they're kind of cool. And then different stiff stuff going on. And these are just some little magnetic clips. I'm liking it. And I've had it like a week and a bit. And it's working really well for me so far. So I did buy some other bits and pieces to go with it. This is from the Arc system, which is from Staples, so it isn't doesn't mix with those. But this is basically a little notepad, and it will tab out of the top here. So this is just a list of things I need to get by for work. So that's just getting there because I can pull that out when I need to. I think this was like three pounds for this pack, and so there's loads on there. 
Um, what else did I get from the Arc system? Yeah, I got these, um, which are A5, so they are not really the size that fits in this. But I just needed to take some notes and stuff, and I like to just have notepaper on me because I'm trying to now not use my Midori um, inserts for notes for work. So I just got those and said they were not a couple of quid. Okay, I then brought some other plannery bits. Um, these are from the Carpe Diem snap planner and these are just the magnetic bookmarks and I really love them. Um, I will probably use them as bookmarks as well. <coughs> I haven't done any book videos lately, mainly because I'm listening to audiobooks more. <coughs> Sorry guys, so two of these are in my planner already. But they're really cool and simple. I then got some happy planners, the stickers that go with them. Um, these are great, so I thought these would be good for easy decorating, but I thought I could also use these in Project Life. Um, so, if I completely go off the boil and not decorate the planner, these are still going to be useful because I can use them in Project Life. These are the ones that are like all quotes, and they fit in their boxes as well. Um, I really love quotes, I love going on Pinterest and looking at quotes and stuff, so I just picked those up as well to decorate my planner with. <coughs> I then picked up these, which is the 24 um, pieces, which are, these are the little, they're cards that go in and you can just put them in your planner, whether it's to remember a certain thing or just to decorate it. Um, I thought this would just be good to mark pages and different things in. They are just single sided, so you could write notes on the back. And so there's some that are glittered and some that are foiled. And again, they're just really pretty. And again, they're not new. I know that this plan has been out. And I know that all the, oh, the craze at the moment is about the Carpe Diem um, snap planner. But as I said, that's just a file of facts to me. <laughs> so I thought I'd go with something a bit different. I then picked up these, which are the pre-punch pockets. And I do have one of these in my planner already. And this just means that I can just easily stick stuff in and that's often stuff for work I'll have emails and stuff I'll print out that I'll tuck in so they're really good I might end up putting one at the front as well okay I don't want to go on too long because I know some people really aren't into planners I then picked up um, this which is the extra covers um, what I have done is I've the bits that I pulled out I've kept aside because I want to use this in my project life so this um, currently planning thing Bob these are just ones that were for um, October and stuff so I've just pulled those out so I can either clip those in as note pages or use them for something else again this I can always just use the scrapbooking as a bit of paper so they won't go to waste so these are the different um, covers you've got so you've got this gold foil one which is pretty and you can use that on the back as well because most of them have a design on them this gold foil with the wood grain the heart on I really love that this is then just a simple heart heart piece these are all blank and then this one says love this life and I really like that one I'm tempted to change my planner to that one but I'm going to keep it with that for now so I just picked those up and I think they were about six seven pounds so love those and that's what I was kind of like not too worried about digging them up and stuff because you know I thought well I can just easily just put another cover on and I love the Erin Condren and I, you know I see people use it I think this is a very similar sorry guys for the rustling a very similar format and I would never pay like by the time I got it over here to UK it's something ridiculous like 60 pounds which is just crazy I would never pay that um, and I got this from Hey little magpie, so luckily I could use my design team discount on that, so that's quite cool. I picked up another couple of stickers. This is this the Heidi Swap, and this goes with her memory planner. I just really like these, um, and again, these are like a couple of quid. So I just picked those up. Um, and I picked these up, which these are the ones you get like in dollar stores and stuff in the US. Um, I just And they're just really sweet, and I've seen quite a few people on um, you do planners and stuff, and different people share these that they get and I mean these only cost I think these cost me like a couple of quid so even though you pay like a dollar for them but I thought these are good and I got them for Christmas ones so I could just decorate my planner a little bit for Christmas because I you know I thought I'm still probably going to be in the mood to decorate it then um and then I've said in um some recent 
videos I don't know if it's been up yet um because I can't remember what order I'm going to be posting these which is why I've got a planner so I can write these things down I want to use my silhouette more so I brought some sticker paper and I've been finding different designs some of them like this I think is a Felicity Jane one but it's actually in the silhouette store some of these are freebie um pdf files and I don't have the designer edition um, silhouette software, but I have Photoshop, so I can just import them in Photoshop, save them as a JPEG and do it that way. I kind of think I might as well do that one extra step than pay more money for a designer studio. So I've got these, and these ones are super cute. And this is from <coughs> something Glam Studios, Vintage Glam Studios, I think. But I love those. So, and some of these, again, are just from the studio, um, silhouette studio store. So again, I'm hoping that's going to mean that I'm going to use it slightly more. So yeah, just wanted to share this quick planner haul. I know, I really don't need another hobby. I'm not going to get like engrossed into it. Um, because at the end of the day, I got this to help me be organised and to help me actually plan stuff. Um, and at least appear like I know what I'm doing. Um, I went to a work meeting on Friday and actually someone commented on my planner and was like oh wow that's a really good planner I love how you can put things into it da, da. and you know when you like you want to say stuff about it but you don't want to appear like too keen or too geeky I was a little bit afraid because I was like oh my god yeah it was really cool and you can get from here and you can get this and they were just I think they were a little bit like okay <laughs> so yeah a little bit maybe too keen but I really love this and so I'm super excited to see how I get along with it you can get expander rings as well um you can get pink and gold ones i kind of like this blue you know it's fine it works for me so anyway that was my little planner haul i'm not gonna you know annoy you much more with planning but i just want to show you because i had spent a little bit of money on this um and i recently shared um how i like how i'm now storing my washi on tapestry rings so again that's another reason why i've done that so it's gonna be easy just to decorate in here <coughs> again this is just some glittery bits but I have used a little bit of washi and um, in here some little thin bits and pieces again it's just a little bit of fun really so thank you very much guys for watching I know not everyone's into planner stuff but I just wanted to share it with you so thank you very much guys and I'll speak to you all again very very soon bye